Okay, here is another slightly tricky problem because our two factors both have a variable in them. So I just want to show you how we can do this with the box method. I'm going to put the first factor up top here on my box and the second factor down the side. Doesn't really matter which one you do which way. So when I multiply these two, x squared times x squared, I get x to the fourth power, thinking back to our factor rules. Um, and then I'm going to multiply 2y times x squared, and I get either 2x squared y or 2yx squared. I tend to do it this way because I like to put them in alphabetical order, but either way is right. They both mean the same thing. So negative 2 times x squared times y. I did it so these two match. I'll cross this off just so I don't have extra things. And then negative 2 times positive 2 gives us negative 4. y times y gives us y squared. These two zero each other out, so there's not going to be a middle term in this. That means the answer to this is x to the fourth power minus 4y squared. So if you're still having a little bit of trouble with this, I would suggest you try numbers 32 and 33. And let me know how you do on those to see if we can um, improve our understanding. Thanks for the question.